Well, it is probably the perfect place to take in the fall colors way up high on the new sky bridge on Boyne Mountain. Our Paula Tuttman got the lucky assignment to check out the new attraction. And Paula, what's it like up there? It looks a little shaky. Yeah, okay, so lucky is a relative word, right? So if the bridge is rocking, don't come a knocking. But take a look at my office view today. Look at these fall colors. Absolutely gorgeous. And now, ladies and gentlemen, let's go up to drone four. This is the sky bridge. It is windy. The wind is pushing the bridge. It is a different experience every single time. I'm about 250 feet in ahead of me, a little more than 700 feet, maybe closer to 800 feet, and all of these people coming right at me, and it is changing the bridge. It's a different experience every time you walk it, no matter who you're walking it with. But I can tell you this, they got this thing opened in the last week or so, and thus far it has been a hit. And if you say, really? Why? Why Boyne Mountain? It was a natural. Boyne Mountain really had the right topography for it. We had these two natural peaks in this valley, perfect for building a bridge. And we really like to call this an all thrills, no skill activity because anybody virtually can enjoy it. You know, you don't have to have that skill set of, you know, being a skier or a golfer or, you know, some of the other attractions we're known for. So this is something that everyone can come up and see and experience and enjoy it. You know, another one of the beauties of this kind of construction is it really is a thrill ride, but it is human and emotion powered because it's different depending on who's on the bridge with you and, and what season you're actually walking it. We love it. It's a beautiful day. It's a little scary out here, but it's gorgeous view. Oh my God, she's, yeah. gonna, she's gonna throw up. Oh my God. Oh my God. You're squeezing my hand to death. I know. <laughs> I'm afraid I, of heights. <laughs> she's like, why on earth are you doing this, Gail? Because I'm 73. It's my birthday and you're supposed to just think out of the box. <laughs> oh my God, this bridge is moving. Yeah, you know what, and, it, and it's still moving. Look at all the people on the Sky Bridge on a Friday afternoon, lucky enough to get the day off, score the day off, and enjoy this amazing new attraction. Come on back to me, folks, off the drone, back to me, so I can tell you, I do want you to come, oh, baby, oh, yeah. <laughs> that thing is rocking, that thing is rocking, and I am not afraid at all. Okay, that's not true, but I will tell you this, I saw some five-year-olds, I wanna be brave like them, or maybe it's just the foolishness of youth, but come on back stay with us because in our five o'clock hour we're actually going to talk to the ceo of the company that actually imagined this and pulled this off she is fascinating to listen to and hey go ahead and pan up real quick i want you to take a look at these cables i'm doing this to my partner on a rocking bridge <gasps> three inches wow. of cables on either side and it's keeping all of these people up they call it engineering i call it magic Christy, back to you. This is amazing, Paula. The first thing I thought it was, wow, you are there with peak colors. And then number two, I think I'm just going to hang on to one of the one of the slats on the side and not go anywhere. Sorry, this is so great. Thanks so much. We'll see you at five o'clock. Looking forward to it.